now begin this bulletin by bringing you the recent COVID-19 updates from across the world. In the recent media briefing on the ongoing COVID-19 outbreak, the World Health Organization chief, Dr. Tedros Adhanom, said that the pandemic is not even close to being over. Even after six months into the pandemic, the world is nowhere close to witnessing the end to this deadly infection. The WHO chief also warned that the worst could be still coming in the ongoing pandemic. Some countries are now experiencing a resurgence of cases as they start to reopen their economies and societies. Most people remain susceptible. The virus still has a lot of room to move. We all want this to be over. We all want to get on with our lives. But the hard reality is this is not even close to being over. Although many countries have made some progress globally, it's, the pandemic is actually speeding up. The COVID-19 cases have seen a meteoric rise in the span of six months and have engulfed the length and breadth of the entire world. More than 10 million cases have been reported so far, with more than 500,000 fatalities. According to the WHO chief, test, trace and quarantine are the only ways to curb the spread currently as the world still awaits a proper vaccine to eliminate this infection. More than half the world's cases were initially reported from the US and Europe. Although Europe has managed to slow down its infection rate, the U.S. still continues to witness a drastic surge in COVID-19 numbers. The U.S. has reported more than 2.6 million cases with more than 128,000 deaths due to COVID-19. Brazil is currently the second worst affected country after the U.S. The country has reported more than 1.3 million confirmed cases with more than 57,000 fatalities. Uh, the Americas as a whole represent half the cases and uh, uh, and half, the, almost half the deaths in the whole world, um, and uh, the uh, uh, if we look at uh, the if you uh, if you look at Brazil itself, uh, it represents uh, quite a proportion of all the cases in in the Americas. Uh, Twenty six six percent. That's one in four of all the cases, and one in four. Of, of all of, of all the deaths uh, in the continent, so there's no question that Brazil is still facing uh, a big a big uh, a big challenge.